Alright, here's my view of the Smart Droid. It's like a berserk kind of berserk ROM, I think the this said. Go into system settings. My phone. As you can see, it doesn't really say much, but it's a mixture between Sense 3.6, Sense 4.0, and uh, AOSP. Kind of reminds me a little bit about a little bit of uh, AOKP with the tweaks it has. So you can see like the little toggles. Um, you do get tweaks with it, extra settings as it's called here. The toggles, you can change the toggles. You can rearrange them to like whatever toggles that you want. Hit back. Cancel, I guess. Hit. You can change the toggle order. So if you want Wi-Fi at the bottom, I like my Wi-Fi and data both at the top. Just stay kind of together. The brightness location. So you can see the little dot at the top above the toggles. You can change that to the bottom. And now the little dots on the bottom. Um, I kind of. Then you can change the toggle style. I have the icons only. You can change it to text. Or it actually lets you know what each one is individually. Or you can change it to where there's nothing. There's no icon and no text. Sorry about that beep. It was a battery dying. I don't know if you heard it through the camera. Let's see. There's nothing by them. I kind of like the icon. You can also change it to where there's the alternate. Like where it's kind of like the CM9 kind of toggles. Change brightness location back to the top. Now the clock. You can have the clock in the center, no clock, or on the right side. The clock is normally on the right side. I, I kind of like it on the center. It looks pretty cool. You can have the regular AM, PM. Or you can have small, or you can have where it just don't show at all. On AOKP, you can have the day of the week up there. But you can't really have that on this one. I think the day of the week up there looks nice because it's had that small and then the AM, PM small. Um, you can have the battery icon. Up there in the top right is the icon with text in the center of it. Icon with center text. You can just have icon with text. The text is kind of next to it a little bit. I like the little icon. <coughs> Sorry, I'm getting sick. <clears throat> um, have the battery bar location. You can hide it, or you can have it in the see the bar at the top. Um, battery bar style, center, like where it goes from left to right. However much battery you have, you can change the thickness and the charging animation of it. And custom carrier, I have it set for T-Mobile, as you can see, because that's my carrier. You can change it to whatever you want. I'm not really going to mess with that. Um, but other than that, it's pretty much stock on the settings. Um, it uses the Apex launcher, as you can see, and also uses the Xperia Home. You do get the Sense 3.6 clock widget 4x1, and you get the Sense 4 clock widget. Where it's, oops, go back. See, you get the Sense 4 clock widget where it looks like the clock in Sense 4. Sorry about the battery dying issue. Um, you can get the Sense 4 widget for any phone. I, I had it on my EO 3D on AOKP and CM9, so that's not really anything too spectacular. Um, the dialers kind of changed. As you can see, the lines are kind of thicker than the regular. Um, go back. You can press and hold home. Close out your applications. Just swipe. You can swipe them all the way. Browsers default messaging. Pull that away. You go into new message. 
um, we have the default Sense keyboard, like the Sense 4 keyboard. And also you have like a blue kind of theme. Little Xperia Home. Um, this does have system wide beats so like it has the Sense 4 audio files. Um, it's ba it's it's a sense based ROM with AOSP features. So as you can see it actually runs pretty fast. It has it comes with torch, a Wi Fi calling, that sense four clock. It comes with Google Plus. You can see everything's got this kind of blue theme. Well ICS has a blue theme, but this has this takes it a little bit farther. Um it's got Elixir. Not really sure what this is. So this tells you what's running in the background. Your system, so your sensors and it's running. Uh it comes with a lot of these these widgets. You can change these. Um show you the widgets that it comes with. It comes with APW bookmarks, APW calendar, Facebook messaging, people, say what, timeline, Twitter. Um it has the El Elixir widgets. Um you can see the sense four by one clock, sense four o'clock widget, then weather widgets. See if you can just put in the zip code. Yeah. Hit done. And it shows the weather in like a little animation for Middleburg, Florida. That's where I'm at. Um, this wallpaper in the background doesn't come with it, by the way. Here's a cool little transition effect by the Sony Home. If you install Apex Launcher, it looks pretty much like stock ICS though. But that's pretty much it for the um smart droid Zircon. Ah, I have a link to it in the description. But that was my review.